Capricorn, welcome to your July reading. I'm Robin Carline from Robin's Authentic Tarot and thank you for visiting my channel. Let's see what you have in store for you. Ooh, the Queen of Cups. This is beautiful. So this one here is uh, very intuitive. Now, there is very much intuitiveness in the air right now. There is a heightened intuition. There is a lot of shifts, a lot of transition that's going on. And so this one represents that this queen, there's that deep trust, that deep knowing, that that belief that you know that everything's going to be okay. There's, there's that adornment. There is like you're taking care of, you're taking care of what it is that is, is important close to you. So whether that is in your personal life or that is in any type of relationship that you have, but also your career and your business. Oh, oh, look at this. So this one coming up as a challenge. So it is decision time. And what kind of choices? Ooh, ooh, this is, this is, this is good because there is so much transition and whether you have gone through transition yourself Capricorn or you know someone that has and you probably do and what I mean by transition is like life-changing events which would be say moving um new job uh new relationship like a uh, new epiphany new mindset like there's there's all sorts of things but there's there's so much transition that's going on right now. And so this here is saying that it, it's, it, it, it is decision time. That's why it's coming up as a challenge. If this wasn't coming up as a challenge, it would still mean that this is decision time, but maybe this is you having a difficult time making a decision on something that we just discussed with the first card there, which could be relationships, could be work. So you have the belief energy and this is the moon. So with this one Capricorn, what I love here is there's those pillars. So those pillars represent that you're moving into a new energy. Now this one here, the moon, it, it, it means of uh, uh it, it's sacral chakra energy so it's like the doozy of um the energies that for the for the sacral chakra it is relationships it is how you are attracting things into your life it's how you're earning your money this is how like your self-worth your self-love um but but this is you here and there's that pathway and it goes all the way through so the most important relationship is the one to yourself and how you are ooh, and how you are honoring yourself, how you're honoring yourself Capricorn for this month, for moving forward. What is it that you're doing for yourself? Make sure that you are putting yourself first. This one here is another major arcana and this one is the hermit. I love the hermit. This one is collecting wisdom. Oh, I love this one. So I know it doesn't look appealing, but this is really awesome. It for me, I, I for me, I, I feel like I'm a hermit. I love going within, and this is like, um, like top three chakra stuff. So like uh, the crown chakra, first of all, because there's so many things going on right now. So much divine guidance being given. There's also the third eye. So the messages that you are receiving and then the communication with just the throat chakra, <laughs> as I'm having trouble saying that with the throat chakra. And so there's that, there's that expression, that self-expression. And are you expressing yourself the way that you want? That is the root card. Let's see what you have for your present energy. Oh my gosh. 
I love this. So you have your energy here. This is the completion card. This is the 10 of pentacles. That is amazing. That is success. That's happiness. That's joy. That's foundational. Like that's, that's, oh, that's wealth. Oh my. <gasps> Overflowing abundance. Oh my gosh. See, it's being handed to you. This is beautiful in this beautiful, gorgeous chalice. The chalice. Ooh, I love. Oh my gosh. So this being that water energy, that's that sacral chakra energy as well. This is talking about new things that are happening like big new things. Ooh, talking about transition, talking about intuition, talking about divine guidance, divine guidance, divine guidance, <laughs> divine guidance. Oh my, wow. That is amazing. Capricorn. Ooh, okay. So, oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> so you have two more cards here and this one here, this is representing a leap of faith. Oh my gosh. Decision time. I love that. Oh my gosh. Then you have the queen of pentacles. Oh my gosh. So this is the second queen that you've received. This one is full of lushness and abundance. This one also, you the, the queen is looking at that, taking care of that pentacle. That is that nurturing. That is that that loving, that is like you loving yourself, you knowing your worth, you moving uh, through like effortlessly. That's like, I feel like there's like a smooth transition. I love that. Oh my gosh. Okay. That's way too many cards there. Can't do that. We're looking for the internal energy. Oops, here we go. And this is the Eight of Cups. This is representing that there's something that you could be leaving that is structurally sound. This one, the cup energy, all the cups are standing up. They're all full. They're all abundant. But you are looking for more. There's something that you desire. And so you're perfectly fine with walking away and you're looking for something else. Mm, it's that cup energy. It's that relationship with self. It's that honoring yourself, Capricorn. I love that. Loving that. I love your reading. So we're looking for the extreme external energy. Thank you. Oh. Victory. <laughs> this is a six card. I love the sixes because the six is after the five and the five is representing that transition. The six is representing that you've passed a little bit, you've passed a little bit through that for that external. So it's showing that it's victory coming to you. This is that fire energy. And this is the first fire card that you've received in your reading. So this is amazing. I love this victory. Oh, yeah, it's the it's it's like, um, all of the ideas, all of the, like, there's all these little buds here. There's, there's like all these opportunities, all these things coming to you. Um, but really, really high vibe energy, uh, 2022, it equals six. So that, that's amazing. I love that. I love that it's fire. Okay. This, wow. This is amazing. So now you have another ace, Capricorn. This is lovely. Oh my gosh. Now you have that portal energy there, that new path energy. You're being handed this pentacle. This is your energy. That is so beautiful. <clears throat> Excuse me. And you also have the nine of pentacles. Again, your energy. 
look at that that bird there representing freedom that is so gorgeous look how close those pentacles are to you they're sticking to you you are attracting that pentacle you're attracting oh like like that really amazing the the kind of foundation the security the money all of that that you want that is amazing wow okay so let's look for your outcome card oh i have one that's turned over here i'm just going to turn that back around and that one was turned around i noticed that one before but uh, if you wanted to know what that was that was the seven of pentacles and that one would have been representing uh like waiting for the harvest so hey that's great energy Ooh, oh so this one, the four of swords, this is representing, this is representing a couple things. This is representing taking a rest, taking a break. This is representing, uh, like, you know, taking care of yourself, but with that sword energy, it represents going deeper. It represents the, uh, the divine guidance. So divine guidance, your higher power, what is it that you're receiving? It represents meditation. It represents going within and looking for that wisdom for yourself. So you have this here, collecting wisdom. Ooh, I I love that. That That's actually, it's, it's very, very important. Like you lying down, you taking time for you, you finding that space for yourself you have the sword that's there and then you have these swords here so that's representing like the crown chakra the the third eye chakra the communication the throat chakra so very very important i love that uh paying attention to source energy paying attention to the heightened intuition that is happening in this july I love this. I love this reading for you. This is extremely abundant, very, very positive for you, Capricorn. I am so extremely excited for you. Have an amazing July. I thank you for showing up for yourself. I thank you for showing up and listening to me. And I thank you for all of your support for my channel. Mwah. I love you all.